Hi everyone, welcome to Revix Dev Don here, and I wanted to show you a little tip on how to make your Warframe look beautiful. What I constantly see is this blurry avatar 2. By that I mean very cold and dark colors, lots of blur, no sharpness, and overall looks like, I don't know, pre alpha. But if you want to make your game look like this. Then stay tuned because it's coming in right in a second. So let's get straight to options. Display, make sure it's full screen or at least full screen windowed mode, I guess. Set it up to your highest resolution with the maximum refresh rate. And that is the amount of frames per second that you see with your bare eyes. So if you have 60 FPS in game, you'll be able to notice or see those. If you'll have a 120 Hertz or a 144 Hertz monitor and you'll have above 60 FPS in game, your eyes will be pleased. <laughs> Aspect ratio should be 16 by 9 in most of the cases if you have a 21 by 9 monitor then obviously put the put it 21 by 9 now i would recommend you to have v-sync off just to get more fps as possible obviously with no limitations though there is some information that an insane amount of fps like thousands are not very good for your graphics card but personally i never had any problems and i had those very off believe me now this part is very important brightness is almost up to maximum like 19 95 percent let's say but don't apply these settings right now don't click apply or okay because your eyes might bleed from the flashbang explosion put contrast around 60 70 percent let's say and the field of view up to the maximum now we turn off adaptive exposure anisotropic filtering and anti-aliasing and color correction the constant weapon trail is up to you the ones that i said to turn off will change the look of your game drastically it's going to be sharpie you'll be able to see so many details just look at the difference this looks like freaking graphics buff 2.0 by revix dev no jokes it's so much cleaner. It doesn't look like a sci-fi anime anymore. Now, obviously, all of the shaders, shadows, particle, and textures quality, it's up to you. My specs are i7, 47, 90K, a GTX 970, and 32 gigs of RAM. That's why I leave everything basically high, up to maximum, because it sort of handles it. If your graphic card doesn't, low it i guess turn off the nvidia physics maybe though fps drops are obviously inevitable i face them also very oft. so this is basically it i turned all the hood off for it to look more cinematic that's why i don't have any radar health ammo aim and so on and i challenge you to survive like this an hour on tower four <laughs> can you do it so i've been playing with these video settings all the time and it's one of the things that kept me launching the game over and over when, you know, you were bored, you had nothing to do. Because, I mean, you're seen by yourself. It's beautiful, isn't it? I'll leave you alone with some cool music because maybe you're tired already of my commentary. Check our social media, like and subscribe for more stuff like this. And I guess we'll see you in the next one, Tenno. Enjoy. Come, come, come.